kick off, I'm going to start the watch. Okay. So as soon as you start sprinting, yeah. I'm going to start the stopwatch. Okay. We're on zero. Yeah. And then when you come through here, I'll stop, stop the watch. Yeah. That's good. Right around. All the way around. All the way around. Yeah, bring it in. Bring it in. Straight through. Okay. What'd you get? 18.60. Oh, that's exactly what I got. 18.6. Okay, 18.60. Now, what I want you to do, okay, yeah. I'm going to break it down for you. Okay, I want you to break it down. And one of the ways we'll break it down is I want you to start from here. I want just to sprint to the 18. Uh -huh. I'm going to take a time. Okay, so it's the same again. You take up when you're ready. Three point zero three. Okay. Forty five. I want you now to start from if you walk across the end of the engine and sprint across it. Yeah. Sprint across it again. So what's he sprinting at a diagonal or just straight? Oh, no, across? just just straight across. Straight the, across. It, it, either line, either yeah. Or, yeah. either. Or, so. Okay, so we've got three, three point zero three across, and six point four zero this way. So I want you to think now, and what we're going to visualise is you're doing is the next run. I want you to think of running three for the eighty, six, three, and six. And what does that give us? If we can do a three, a six, a three, and a six. What's that going to give us, time-wise? Who's, who's the mathematician? 18, 18, 18, 18. 18, 18. Okay, so we get a three, and a three, and a six. We can we can shave. What was the time? We 18.3. 18 point something. Okay. Okay. So you might get it down to 18 flat. Right? Yeah. Okay. And bearing in mind we've got the turn as well. Yeah. That's, that's okay. Cool, yeah. The turn's going to come into it too as well. Okay. So we're going to see if we can bring it down, okay, uh, and visualize it. So I just want you to come across here before we do the run, okay. I want you to just close your eyes, relax, okay, and run through the run in your mind, okay. Just imagine starting off, sprinting, getting to the end. to really imagine, imagine watching yourself on TV and sprinting to the end, in three, turning, getting to the other end, then turning, getting to the other end, in say 14, okay, and bringing it in just under 18, okay, so we sprint, let's get under 3, sprint across, under 6, and turn, under 12, bring it across and under 18 and just keep going through that in your mind and imagine doing it here and now okay okay so before you do that I need you to visualize it first of all okay what I want you to do is when you set off running in your mind you arm up when you start the run imagine yourself sprinting Doing that, and obviously you would carry on doing that. So what was his last time? Seventeen point one. That's great. Proved it already. Well, this will be the whether we can uh, do it in. He, do, he doesn't have to do the run. He's already done. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah.
Yeah. Are you ready? Yeah. So as soon as you take off, I'll start to watch. Okay. You ready? It's like he's running with uh, more um, urgency. Yeah. More intensity and more enthusiasm. Uh, Seventy-two. Seventeen point two five. Exactly what I got. Seventeen point two. Yeah, you visualise that. No, I was, like, I was counting. I'm like one, and then like, I visualised yeah. it. And then, like, Do you get them to use the environment now? So it was was like a demonstration of how powerful the process is. Of course, yeah, we could do the wind, the grass, your feet, and everything for that matter. But what is really interesting was that when we did the second one. When I did the second visualization, because the first one, I said, bring your arm down when you finish. So I influenced what was going on. But the second one, I said, before you started the run, yeah. you bring the arm down. And what did we get? 17.1. Was it 17.1 that we got roughly? Yes, yeah, 17.1. And we got 17.25. Yeah. So it's 0.15 of the difference yeah. by just seeing yourself doing it, which is key. But what's interesting too, you might think, okay, what's one and a half seconds? Well, one and a half seconds would that say from here? Probably. So we'll um, make our way back into the uh, 